get to the side, look. Open the knees wide. Try not to stay with your knees too close together. Expose yourself for a lot of sweeps and disadvantages. Open up, lower your hip. Stay here. Hand on one side, go hand on the other. Be aware if you put your hand on this side, that leg is going to try to get you in the half guard. If this starts to happen, reach. And you hit the other way. Put a little bit of pressure here on the ribcage, pushing into it. So you can control this arm a bit. At least get it out of the way with your body. And then you can mount. Then you have to pop. Keep, keep your body really, really low. And go to the mat. Everything nice and tight. And as low as you can. So you have side control. Depends on what he's trying to do to you. If he's trying to get you in the half guard, change. Okay. If the arm gets caught underneath you, Try to pull the arm up here. Sometimes you expose yourself too much. And as you pull, he puts the elbow down on the floor to protect it. To try to pull that is pointless. Don't try to do it. The arm is hidden. So look. That's what I feel like hell. Start bothering his neck here. And then you can come with your knee. Pull. Lock up. Reach. Finish. Same choke that we did before. It works extremely well from top to top. Very good. Gun balls on one side, four fingers on the other. So it's crazy. Wanna do the movement? Clean the arm with your hip. See how it works? Yep. Mm -hmm.